the baby right out our front door. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I bring you Young and Homeless. Yeah, I know I've been um, posting teen pregnancy a lot. It's because I had a lot planned for that and I wanted to get it out. And plus, once I start like recording one episode, I want to keep recording that Let's Play. So you know how it is. Um, but anyways, I'm back with Jordan and we have some good news. That's why she's, you know, smiling and stuff. But basically, we got a call from the judge and saying that we're off probation. So originally, we were supposed to have two days of probation here at the juvie center. And he basically, I mean, she basically was saying that um, we were doing really good. You know, we cleaned, laundry, um, and then stayed out of trouble. So he let us off the hook. So we will be going home today. Uh, well, tonight. We're supposed to be going home like around eight o'clock ish i believe so yeah jordan is super excited about that because she gets to go home and later on we will be picking up um our brother josiah so that's good news as well um so yeah i'm so happy for jordan and that she gets to go oh look she's so happy for us to like girl you get to get out yes okay <laughs> um so when we go back home we're definitely gonna be uh, let's get her i mean ask about her baby because she's ready to pop soon like girl why is you walking in here like you own the place girl if you don't get into your outfit what are you doing Um, so yeah, we're supposed to be leaving around 8 o'clock-ish. Why can't we talk to her? Okay, whatever. But I want to give them to a hug and tell them that we're going to be leaving. So we're going to see you guys. Um, these are our only two friends here. Them other two girls, I don't know. They're just, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I want to give them both a hug. I don't know why we can't get Haley one. That's okay. So yeah, we're gonna be leaving at eight. We're trying to get I'm not sure, I guess. <laughs> um and it is almost winter. Y'all, we're gonna be struggling. But I want her to actually start writing her book, her next book. Um let's do a poetry book why not or actually we can do a non-fiction book I think that would be better right now so let's do a non-fiction book and by the way don't mind the background noises um my little sister is watching tv and she got the tv about super what the oh I have to take that money off because she went to work but yeah, my sister is playing the TV like super loud and it's working my nerves. <laughs> but I'm going to take this money off because it's not ours. Okay, so I took the money off. And look at her little bump. It's so cute. Girl, come here. You're not supposed to be at home. Um, let's write this book. Girl, I told you to write it. Nonfiction. Um, stop chatting. Jordan and Dale brain feels about three and a half sizes too large for the head space. Oh, she still has this headache. Uh, oh, I actually have a name for this book. Um, so the book will be called Trapped because she feels like she's trapped in this area and stuff. Because um, she has no freedom, you know, it's a gated space and everything. And I think she had her, yeah, she had her royalties for her book. So she has 168 for her first one and then 224 for her second one. So yeah, she got her royalties and oh, oh my gosh. 
She's going into labor? Girl, I didn't think he was gonna go right now. We should go with her since we're leaving, actually. Oh my gosh. Join her. Yeah, we're gonna go with her. Because, why not? I feel like we're closer to Valerie than anybody else in this place. So yeah, we're gonna go with her. We were leaving soon anyway. Okay, so we made it to Willow Creek Hospital with Valerie. And oh my god, I really can't believe she's giving birth. Y'all. <laughs> and she's supposed to be a teenager, so um, when she gives birth, I'm gonna age her back down. So she could be a teenager. But we're gonna come over here and check in for her. So come and check in at the front desk. Oh, this headache is killing her, but it's okay. It's almost over. And then you, Valerie, you can go over there. Oh my gosh, is her water break? Well, of course it did. But I'm never actually seeing Sims do that. Like the little animation. It's cool. Overall, she's feeling okay besides the labor part. So that's good. Is they going to take her in yet? I want to tell her that it's going to be okay. You got this. Okay? No, not that. I meant to give her a hug. Ciao. Oh, friendly. More. And then hug her. And tell her, girl, you got this. It's going to be okay. You're meant for this. You got it. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> you know, just cheer her up while she's in you know so much pain are you gonna give her a hug where are you going uh-uh she's trying to go play games like girl no are you gonna give her a hug is the doctor even over there no what the heck um oh okay there she go i was gonna say come on now and then uh Jordan, you can go there as well. Why are my sims just standing here? You about to piss me off. Um, oh, she's gonna be in this room. Okay, go here. Ah, I'm so excited for her. Oh my gosh. Y'all, I don't know her story or her background and i don't really want to ask her because it may be sensitive who knows but um yeah we're just gonna be a good friend and support her why is my game lagging can you not <laughs> oh valerie she's having her baby i'm so happy for her we pray that it's a long healthy pregnancy oh a healthy baby at that um, are y'all good? Why are you froze? Child, my game, don't start. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, congratulations, it's a boy. Uh, Valerie just gave birth to a baby boy. This baby needs a name, so I already have a name for him. Um, since his mother name starts with a V, you already know I need to give my Sims, you know, the first uh, letter of their name to be the same. So that is what I'm gonna do. Since her name is Valerie and it starts with a V, his name is gonna start with a V as well. So his name is going to be Vito Austin. So his name is Vito and I think it is a very uh, handsome name, honestly. So here's Vito. Um, uh, can you let her out so she can, you know, grab her baby? Oh, come over here and cuddle your baby. Look at Jordan just standing there like, what did I just witness? <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, They're so cute. Uh, Valerie is so pretty. Oh, the little baby. Yeah. Um, later on, we probably will find out her story and stuff. But for now, since she just had the baby, 
we're just gonna be there and support her and stuff why can't we talk to her we can only give her a gift what the heck okay what do we have in our um inventory oh we don't really have no Ooh, our book we forgot to publish that okay we should do that we can give her is this a picture of of us two um yeah i think so let me see what oh, is we can give her that let's give her a friendly gift with uh, a picture of us maybe she'll like that right okay now what the hell why's my oh crap okay we're going back home well i'll see you guys once we're home okay so we made it back home oh wow i did not know they were gonna come with us um oh my gosh <laughs> the baby right on the front door they left the baby right at our front door okay wow man we can come talk to the baby um let's cuddle him I didn't think they were gonna come with us. I guess she has um, no place to stay or no family or anything. I'm looking Jordan being a mom. <laughs> but yeah, I don't think she has a place or anything to stay. Um, so I guess she can just stay with us for, that means we have to spend more money. <laughs> but that is okay, she is our good friend and we're here to be helpful and support her and stuff so since she has no place to stay then we're gonna offer her to stay at our place and her and her baby will have somewhere to stay because it is gonna be winter soon and i really don't want them out in the cold and you know living on the streets and stuff and scavenging for food and like the dumpster or um, any trash can you know no mother wants to go through that especially in my in this series where Jordan started from the bottom I would I don't want to I, I can't talk I don't want her to go through that since she has a baby and because winter's coming up so we're gonna offer her to stay here okay guys so my game crashed you know it's being weird again but we're back and look at Jordan's face she feels helpless like Jordan don't even really have a lot to give especially a home and real food so she told um Valerie that um she doesn't really have a home and she doesn't really have much money nor does she have plenty of food and sleeping wise you you have a mattress and that's it Valerie was telling her, girl, I don't care about any of that. Did you see where we had to sleep at? I was pregnant at a juvie center place. Like, the least I, they could have gave us was some food and, you know, a better bed and stuff. But Valerie was like, girl, I don't care where you live or nothing. I'm just glad you're here to provide what you have for me. Because there's plenty of people who um who have big homes, lots of money, and wouldn't even do this for you. You know, so Valerie is very grateful for Jordan. And Jordan feels... Jordan is happy about it, but at the same time, she still feels useless, which is okay. Um... But we're gonna give her a hug. It's Navarro to lot to me. Ah, so shum. Karenzi. Even though things didn't, um, turn out for her, <laughs> they will for you. So, I'm gonna go into creative sim and give her, I mean, not give her, uh, age her down to a teen. So, I'll be right back. So we're back, and Valerie, of course, looks different. So I did age her to a teen, if you can't tell. And then Jordan gave her her clothes. So Jordan gave her her um her outfit for Valerie to wear, because we do have two other outfits for ourselves. But we gave her this one, and Valerie is grateful for it. But in the future, we will be giving them some new ones that they can afford and stuff. So. Um, yeah. 
but we're gonna come over here and have like a deep conversation if I can find it no let's give her another hug I know we keep giving out hugs but we're just trying to say that we are super grateful to have a friend like Jordan even though she doesn't have much or um you know she can't give out much we're still so grateful to have her as a friend and have her provide for Valerie because she is so nice I think Jordan and Valerie will become very great friends and not because of um them meeting each other at the juvie center but because they do have some things in common so um they're both very creative so since Jordan wants to write books um Valerie wants to be into art so she loves drawing and expressing her feelings through painting just as Jordan likes to express her feelings through writing Um, So I think they have a lot of stuff in common. And by the way, we do have simoleons, like a lot of it. So I'm going to go into build mode and actually expand this house. Because if Valerie's going to stay with us for a little bit, we're going to need some room. But um, yeah, so I'm going to just speed past this and not do much talking. So yeah. Okay, so um, basically I just added a new room and a new bed for uh, Valerie to sleep in. So she's going to sleep right next to her baby. And since he's crying, we're going to breastfeed him. <laughs> and um, Jordan has to pee. Um, I do want her to make some more money because I want to get a, a tub, like a shower. But we're going to have them eat and sleep. And then once they wake up, we're going to go to our grandma's house and pick up Josiah and then try to do some collecting. So we can get a little bit more money and stuff. So yeah, everything's going to work out. We're definitely going to be good, you know. Um, What is this? Buy a bookshelf and level up a writing skill. You can definitely do that, girl. I want to actually plan on getting her a computer as well so she can actually write here instead of traveling to a whole bunch of places and, um, you know, writing there because that is too much work. We'd rather have our own little computer so we can get things done here. And I actually want Jordan to, you know, live a little and start going out, but... I don't think we should because we do have um, our brother to take care of. And then also I heard that when you breed frogs and give them to another person, um, it, it can breed them. So we're going to try that because girl, you know how much money we can make? Uh, hopefully it works. Oh my gosh, it do work, y'all. Oh my gosh, uh, yeah, we're definitely making money, because this is going to come in handy, and I, I heard that you can do it with toddlers as well, so when we get Josiah, we're definitely going to be giving him the frogs to breed and make through time as, as much money. Oh, yes, mm-hmm, and then we have our daily royalties coming from our books and stuff. We're definitely, definitely going to be working on that. And by the way, no, Valerie is not going to live with us. Um, she's just staying staying with us until she can um, get back on her feet and end up affording a place 
you know so we're gonna give her about three days and see where she is i mean we're not gonna kick her out of course but we're just gonna see where she is within two to three days and if she's doing all right then we're gonna give her her props you can't sleep here girl please come over here because she about to work my nerves <laughs> Okay, so I fixed that and put Vito on the other side of the bed. And one reason why I named him that is because Valerie is Italian and um, black. So I named him that because I think it's a very good Italian name. I don't know, it's my, it's my opinion. Yeah, I think it really is. So I think it's a cute name. But yeah, I'm going to fast forward until the morning and I'll see you guys in the morning. Okay, so Jordan just woke up and she is not feeling too good. Um, her headache went away, but I think it might come back because we didn't cure it. So she is sore from working out. These muscles are sore after exercise, and then she has a sore back from the cheap bed. The mattress was firm. Girl, I know. I know. We're definitely going to be getting better beds. And also, it is winter. And I'm glad that it is, but I'm glad that it's not. And then we have this award ceremony that I completely forgot about. We were, we got a call saying we had an award. I don't remember which, which episode I recorded it in, but we had a reward, an award, not reward, <laughs> from uh, one of our books. And I don't know how do we do that. I don't know if you're supposed to watch TV or something, but yeah, um... Um, I want to plan on doing a lot, so I have to give them a new outfit, because, girl, this sleepwear is a no. We have to throw that out. <laughs> but I'm going to start giving them new outfits once uh, Jordan actually affords a dresser. So whenever she buys a dresser, that's when we're going to be giving them uh, new outfits and stuff. But until then, we have to work to, uh, with what we have you know scavenge for new outfits and stuff and then we're gonna have to wash our old ones but yeah we're gonna be going to our grandmother's house for collecting josiah and also to see if we can figure out this award ceremony thing and then we definitely need to give them new beds because child oh we can publish this i forgot all about that let's um Let's sell to publisher that one so we can get some money. And oh, she's not feeling so good, but it's okay. It's okay. Oh my gosh. Are you finished? I already think. Okay. Um, so we're gonna travel to our grandmother's house and I'll see you guys once we're there. Well, let me breathe this first and then we're going to be there. So we'll read this frog with that one and then sell it for some change. And then now we're going to be on our cover. Actually, I think there's some collectibles around here. So I'm going to try to get those first. See, look, a harvestable here and then a diggable right here. Girl, oh my gosh, 400. Oh my gosh, we got 184 from Jordan, 160 from Court, and then 75 from Josiah. Oh my gosh, we got 400 simoleons from those books. Y'all, all we have to do is just keep selling them and keep selling them, and then we'll be good to go. I did not know it was a pond here. I could try fishing, but... Capsule, so we're gonna sell those, and I said we might sell that treasure map because it's no use. We're gonna keep it for now. 
well, we're gonna go to our grandmother's house and I'll see you guys once we're there. So we made it to grandma's house. Look at your science standing there waiting for us. Oh, give him a hug. We missed you, baby. He was definitely waiting for us. Like, I can't wait to sissy come. Oh, so cute. And now we're gonna come and knock on the door. Oh, look at them. She making funny faces. He making duck faces. Oh, that's so cute. My <laughs> grandma still has her decorations up. Oh my gosh. Um, I wanted to see if we can like choose a channel to watch our award ceremony. I honestly do not know how this whole thing works, bruh. But let's go and talk to her grandma and give her a hug because we miss her. Um, this is uh, Honor, and her mother is Haley from the GV Center. If you don't know, this is Haley's daughter right here, and she came over to Grandma's house because Haley, um, you know, is in Juvie and she don't have anyone to watch her kids. So yeah, she won't be staying for long, just for a little bit until Haley gets out. And yeah. But another thing that I wanted to do is collect over here. So let me see. Oh, wait, I forgot to splinter. So that means I won't be no harvest things. Oh my gosh, I totally forgot. Y'all, okay. Well, we're gonna have to go to some other place that doesn't snow. Um and see if we can try there because yeah but where is our brother i forgot this is also Haley's other daughter um she has two kids two daughters so but where's our brother oh my gosh this big house i can't find him he's not in the playroom I know y'all like, he's right there. Oh, he's right there. <laughs> okay, let me um, add him to the family. And uh, I'm going to have him come talk to... Don't forget. Um, I want Jordan to write her book, also though. Just a girl. So I'm going to have her come up here and Same sit thing. down. And then... Did she finish? No, I don't I think she did. Yeah, so we're gonna resume writing track. You. She ain't never scaring you. Oh my gosh, Grandma, really? Um, hungry. Oh, by the way, that is not her name. I actually imported uh, Haley and her daughters from uh, Felicity. If you don't know her, she's a YouTuber and she created those Sims. And I forgot to change the little baby's name, but yeah, um, she's sleeping right now, so, <laughs> but I'm gonna speed it up a little bit so she can finish writing this book. And I also wanted to um, text Haley, I mean not Haley, Valerie, to check up on her and see if she's doing okay. How is our brother? Oh, he's dancing to the little jukebox. That's cute. Why don't you talk to her? Or like, oh no, let's invite her to dance. That's cute. Oh, Honor is so cute. Look at them, they're so adorable. I love toddlers sometimes. <laughs> Um, let's talk about superheroes, um, talk about our favorite color, and then, 
can just hug. Oh, they're too adorable. Look at the little the bobbin, the moves. <laughs> Okay, so we had to stop what we were doing because the baby is crying and I don't want her to get taken away from her mother. So we're feeding her and then we're going to continue back writing. Um, hopefully, okay, she can't. Um, yeah, whatever. Her fun need is really low and I want her to finish this book before she says she's too tense because child, mm -mm. Oh my gosh, the baby's still crying. Girl. I know, I know, you wanna get some work done. Hell, I wanna get, um, I want you to get some work done too. Look at Honor coming up here like, how's my sister? Sure, whatever, <laughs> I don't care. Oh, I'm not her crying too, Josiah. I'm gonna have him um come up here and talk to her. I'm gonna teleport him. Stop playing with that. And he's gonna come over here and make her feel better. Let's hug her, cause she we can't have two babies crying. Okay, one is enough. Oh my gosh, why he talk like that? He did a little superhero move. <laughs> that was cute. But he's gonna hug her. Oh, is she rejecting him? Oh, oh my god, that's cute though. He's like, she's like, no. Boy, get off me. <laughs> okay, so it is winter and I real I feel okay but at the same time i don't want her to struggle so much in the winter but i want to see how this works are we supposed to watch like a specific channel or something oh she retried number seven okay cool but yeah i don't know how this thing works we like watch the news or the little bet tween thing <laughs> i'm so confused and her headache came back. We really need to give her some medicine. I wanna see if we can order some. So order, and it's supposed to say purchase medicine, right? Child, I do not see it. Or are we supposed to go on the web? Because I don't see it. Okay, if we go to web, no, because then that doesn't make, you know what, girl, you're going to have to do something. I don't know, you're going to have to, because I can't find it, just continue writing. And we'll figure it out later, because um, we could try going to the store and getting some medicine, but I don't feel like doing all that. And she will be going to school tomorrow since she is a D student and since the court basically told us we have to go back to school to prove that we can take care of Josiah on our own and also live on our own, we need to go back to school. So um, my first day of school will be tomorrow and I'm not going to do any type of public school like I did with my teen pregnancy series. So yeah. While every book is different, the joy of finishing a good one is always welcome. Oh, that is so... Oh, she finished it. Yes. And it was an excellent book. Good. So now we can publish that one. And I'm going to have her play some games just to bring her fun up for a little bit. And um, I'm going to have Valerie care for herself just in case she's you know, being a regular Sam and just not doing anything. <laughs> but I'm gonna have Josiah ask for, okay, never mind, we can't do that since we don't have a high chair. But he's getting hungry, so we're going to feed him. 
Oh, we got, oh, we got some grilled chicken in here, garden salad, and then our leftover turkey from Thanksgiving. We're gonna get some grilled chicken. Why can't I drag it out, bruh? Now we have to make her do it. Okay, Jordan, come get this grilled chicken. I can't drag it out for her either. Okay, just grab a serving, and then we're gonna give it to our brother. Cause it wanna be booty. Oh lord, she's not feeling too good. Okay girl, get off this game. So after we're done here, we're gonna go back to our place and then do some probably buy some stuff because we have a thousand simoleons and that could definitely be put to use so girl don't eat that and come and grab a serving for yourself as well so grab the serving and then we're gonna have Josiah come down here and eat it so I'm gonna teleport him down here and then he's gonna oh he teleported fast <laughs> and then he's gonna eat that and we need to uh, put these toys back because these aren't yours these are grandma's you can always come over here to play with them oh it's gonna be a long night Girl, this headache almost over. Look, see, you good. Just listen to the music and you'll be fine. It's getting a little late. It's almost seven. Um, I looked up about the award ceremony and usually said it, it said that usually it starts at 7 p.m. And so we're just gonna look out for that. Oh, grandma got her some turkey too. Okay. And then we re re acquire a dance skill. Oh, y'all, it's seven. Um, I don't know what channel. Child, I am lost. We might just do B E Twin TV and then the news or something. If y'all know what to do, then let me know because I'm lost. Okay, so I didn't find it. But I'm gonna have Jordan take a shower and text Valerie before we go. We're gonna text her and say that we're gonna be on our way soon, and then Josiah is gonna use the bathroom. Um, I would say we can pee at home, and I'm gonna be giving her some new outfits once she gets a dresser. If I didn't mention that already, but we're gonna use the bathroom here since it's right here because I might as well. So yeah, after they're done, we're gonna head back home and this episode is getting way too long. So yeah. Okay, so we're back home and we're feeling a little good. We're just sleepy and stuff. But since we're home, we're gonna go and talk to Valerie and ask her if she's okay. Did everything go smooth here? How's the baby, blah, blah, blah. And then I do wanna do some collecting, but look at all this snow here. It's so much snow. We can build snow belt. Ooh, collectible. But oh my gosh, I didn't think it was gonna be when we first started. It wasn't this much snow. I seen a collectible, so I had to get it. <laughs> and I see some up here too. Okay, I did not know all of this was here. Child, we could have been got these collectibles if I knew they was here. Oh my gosh, I didn't know it snowed so much here. It was barely snowing at grandma house. Just like it, baby, if you're tired, go to sleep. Don't nap. Oh, uh, he's so cute. But uh, we have snow all on our roof. Y'all, it's snowing so much. It makes no sense. And by the way, I do not know how to do roofs. So I tried. I don't really build houses as much. But that's okay. That's why we're learning. And that's exactly why I started her on a lot instead of an apartment because I need to learn how to 
work on my houses and builds and stuff. So, yeah. I'm gonna have her collect a little bit just so we can get some more money and stuff. And then I'm gonna teleport her back here. And then we're gonna sell what we have. So I'm going to extract these. How much was that? Okay, and then I'm gonna extract the other one. Okay, we both got 70, and then, ooh. Oh my gosh, let me sell this stuff. But oh my god, we found, uh, wow. Okay, we're gonna see. And we got another one, yep, we're selling that one. Definitely. But I'm gonna give these to a Valerie so she can breed. Wait, why can I breathe with her? I thought I could. What? Can I give it to Josiah? And have him do it? Let me try. Josiah, get up. <laughs> I'm trying to give these rocks to you, boy. Okay, so let me give these to him and then see if he can breed these frogs. Okay, how come he can but she can't? Okay, that's weird. Whatever. Um, hold on, because I'm really trying to see. I think she glitched or broke. <laughs> but we're going to give these back to Jordan so she can sell them. Um, so we're gonna sell these frogs and then we're gonna sell these this one and then that sunflower one too Then we might as well sell this treasure map, right? Yeah, let's sell it Now we have seventeen hundred dollars. Oh my gosh And let's publish this book too But yeah, we have seventeen hundred dollars. Oh my gosh <gasps> Yo, Jordan Adele has started down the path to stardom. She's earned her very first fame point, which is hers to keep. Oh my gosh, she's a one-star celebrity. I did not expect her to become that so fast. What the heck? Why well, can't find it? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, uh, okay, here it is. We don't have a fame point, bro. But wow, we're one-star celebrity. Oh my god. Y'all, we really starting to make it. But I'm gonna have everybody come outside so I can, like, um, just spend a little bit and see what we can work with. So I'm gonna fast forward and yeah. Okay, so that was me making the rest of this. I basically added in her computer so that way uh, Jordan can just right here and not travel everywhere. And I added a tub as well. Notable newcomer Jordan Adele has started down the path to stardom. I'm actually so so happy for her because I believe that she will actually become a famous author, you know, and write stories about her life and like biographies and stuff and I think people will really be interested to see how she you know got through everything but I'm not gonna like that room but yeah I am so 
I'm proud of Jordan, and I really believe that she can become a successful, uh, famous author. It's just in her. Like, you know, she expresses her feelings through writing and stuff. But this is where I'm going to end the episode. So please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. I love you all, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, angels. Oh,